What's going on, you guys? So, Koki Inoue stops Jehurts Chavez. That's right, I said Inoue. Koki Inoue is Nayo Inoue and Takuma Inoue's cousin. He's the same age as Nayo. I think Nayo, how old is Nayo? 26? So he might be a little older. He's 27 years old, um, 15 and 0 with 12 knockouts. He's still considered a prospect. And he's fighting the super lightweight division, AKA the junior welterweight division, whatever you want to call it. Um, so in that weight class, we got guys like Regis Progray, Josh Taylor, Jose Ramirez, um, 140 pounds. So he's definitely the bigger uh, relative. But yeah, I didn't know they was a really a fighting family like that. I mean, first I heard about Nayoa. And then out of nowhere, I found out that he has a brother that boxed in the same weight class, Takuma, in a way. You know, I never seen I never seen pictures of Takuma prior until I found out about him. Then I start seeing him everywhere. I start noticing him. Then I see that they got a cousin named Koki in a way that I never seen before. And these other pictures with Takuma and Eno and Nioa. Now I see pictures with this dude. So it's just like, what the hell is going on here? But nonetheless, man, I don't really know much about him. Uh, um, he don't even have a picture on his box rec. He's still an upcoming guy. Um, he just won his first minor world title or whatever, minor title. Um, I guess a guy that was like 9-4 with, uh, what's his record? 9-4 um, and two with seven knockouts. Jehurts Chavez from the Philippines. Seems like it's been a lot of uh, Japanese and Filipino rivalry going on. Is that is that like a little rivalry you guys got going on over there? Just let me know in the comment section. Because I've been noticing there's been a lot of Japanese and Filipino boxers um, trying to mix it up and mixing it up lately. I, I do notice that out of all the, um, in the, in the on the Asian side of the world, it seems like the Japanese and the Filipinos are more in tune with boxing than any of the other Asian guys out there. So that's what it just seems like to me. Um, everybody else seems like they're more into martial arts and MMA and things like that. But yeah, um, Koki Inoue, man, you know, um, he's a prospect. I mean, what, what more could you really say? I mean, I, there's not too many, too much footage of him out there that I've seen. Uh, only thing I really know about the dude is that he seems to look up night, look up to um, his cousin Nioa, and he uh, he likes hedgehogs. <laughs> he likes hedgehogs right? Look, this He got a whole bunch of pictures of hedgehogs And he seemed like one of those dudes What's the word I don't know if this is the pro proper um, term But he's like an otaku guy I think that's like a uh, I can't I forgot exactly what that means man But I think he's like some type of anime dude You know I think he like manga And like hedgehogs and shit That's the only thing I got from him But he definitely is the bigger Bigger guy um, He likes to box uh, I think he's a southpaw as well um, I mean the guy he fought this past other day or whatever he used his boxing skill I mean you saw him hit the one two that seemed like to be his money shot the one two you know it's, it's, it's simple it's straight to the point and, 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 and it's effective you know but yeah man that's pretty much all I got I don't want to just babble too much longer if anybody in the comment section know anything about Koki in a way feel free to um, enlighten the world um, we're gonna see if he's gonna um, he got a with Nioa anyway having so much momentum and so much buzz as far as the Asian box, it's going to be hard to kind of, you know, kind of live up to that. But we'll see. You know, we'll see. Tell me what you guys think. Koki Inoue. Like, subscribe. Holla your boy. Peace out.